Today, we're taking a look at Neutron 4. Let's go. Here's the record we're using for the review. How many times have I, 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 I said I love the way you do you? And now that the vibe is I to I sip some wine and let's explore on the kick. But we just got the kick under control. Here is the snare. Brighten it up a little bit. We took a little bit off of the top. The hat. Actually, what I'll do is drop that down. I don't really need the low end on the hat. Now, the room, we did very little, but here's what that sounds like. The bass line. Some EQ, Sculptor to take out the resonance, and a little control with the compressor. A little cameo from a synthesizer. So not a whole lot. We did cut the low end because it was just unnecessary. See all that down there? I find that it messes with your potential for getting a loud master, right? So I, I typically cut those out, especially if it's not really a part of the fundamental of the instrument. Here's the world it served. Cut out some of that extra. Again, low end we don't need. So let me do it again. So we wanted to accentuate some of this stuff. The roads. Then the lead vocal. How many times have I, 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 how many times have I, 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 and some control with the compressor, a little bit of boost on the high end, and then the harmonies before. How many times? I realize I had so much delay on there. Cutting out the low end again because it just it stacks up so we didn't need all of that. The unmask function, we use that on the drum bus. We also use it on the instrument bus. And they are being fed a side chain from the vocal bus for more clarity. Let us take a listen at the result. Again, let me play the before. How many times have I, I, I,
To get your hands on a copy of Isotope's Neutron 4, click the link in the description. Until next time, you've been watching Yish in Your Ear. Stay tuned.